Okay, so let's go to Romans 8.11. So in here it talks about how the sons of man, which, are, which is us, how we are led. So Romans 8, 11, this is one of my favorite scriptures. And it says, but if the spirit of him who raised Jesus from the dead dwells in you, he who raised Christ from the dead will also give life to your mortal bodies through His Spirit who dwells in you. This is a very, very powerful scripture. If you understand this scripture, this scripture literally can keep you from ever getting sick. Because that power of God, the resurrecting power of God, that same Spirit that raised Jesus from the dead, when it starts flowing through you, when it starts just imitating from your body, no sickness, nothing can attach to you. We just need to understand, get that revelation of what it means. Just to allow what God has already put into us, that spirit, that resurrecting power, for it to start flowing out of you. And those rivers of living water, just like they were flowing out of Jesus, also are supposed to flow in out of every believer. And so what that means is that life abundant is flowing out of you so much to where you have so much of it for yourself to where nothing can touch you. So if you have a river of living water flowing out of you, can any, dark, can any dirt get in there? No. Not possible. If water and life is flowing out of you, dirt or death can never come back inside. It's not possible because the force is going that direction. And so we have to start understanding and seeing that it, all God's life that's inside of us is supposed to not be dammed up inside of us. It's supposed to be flowing. We're supposed to see ourselves as rivers of living water, the resurrecting power, the anointing, everything that's inside of us, His glory, the light, everything that He put inside of us is flowing on the outside. And as it's flowing on the outside, it's affecting everything around us. Sickness and disease cannot touch us. They have no right to touch us. The body of Christ needs to realize it and understand that. All sickness and disease have to stop in the body of Christ, and all the sick people around us have to get set free, get healed. And that life, that freedom, starts affecting everywhere we're at. At our workplace, kingdom of God is supposed to prevail. Why? Because you're there. God puts you in the place where you're at, and that life is flowing from you. That freedom is flowing from you. That wisdom is flowing from you. That mind of Christ is just nonstop flowing out of you. You're bringing solutions. You're bringing answers to everywhere you're at. Why? Because you have it inside of you. It's time for us to let it out. Holy Spirit was given to us to bring us into all truth, not to just be buried in there and sit there and be bored. That is not why God put him inside of us. He was put inside of us to be moving out of us, to flow through us, to set the captives free, and to answer every problem. Amen?